when she says red light, you're supposed to freeze. Freeze? But I'm not even cold. <laughs> Get it? Freeze? Cold? Mommy! I know, I know. I'll go back. Okay. Yeah, we all have a lullaby. I 
I hear it. Think that's alibi, bud. That's what I said. Lullaby. But, but I wasn't even near the kitchen. Huh. Look what I found in the kitchen. Gee, Gonzo, we'd like to believe you, but all the evidence keeps pointing to you. But I didn't do it. Sounds to me like we should have a trial. A trial? A trial? Well, I saw it on TV. A trial takes place in a courtroom. There's a judge, and when the judge comes in, everybody has to stand up. Judge Hopner, stand up. Okay, uh, you, you can all sit down. And now we'll, uh, uh, now we will, uh... What do we do now, Scooter? I think we need two lawyers. One guy who thinks Gonzo did it. All right, Skeeter, since you found Camilla, you should be that guy. Oh, well, okay. Then we need another lawyer who thinks he didn't do it. Okay, uh, who wants to be the guy who defends Gonzo? <laughs> Gonzo, do you think that's a good idea? Sure, I'm innocent. What could go wrong? Sheesh. Okay, then, uh, let's begin. Judge Hoffner, I would like to call my first witness. Uh, sure, Skeeter, go ahead. Yeah, and it's claimed that you're the little glue, too. So, which is it? 
Oh, are you 
Camilla by the broken cookie jar. Yes. And Gonzo's the only one without an alibi. Yes. So I think Gonzo is, um, is, um... Gonzo is I think Gonzo's innocent. <laughs> what? I mean, no one really saw who broke the cookie jar. And if Gonzo says he's innocent, we should believe him. That's all. Weirdo. 